Hello friends, hi, how are we today? I hope we're all doing well. A bit of a different video for you today. Uh, I'm really excited to do my July 2023 Bujo setup. I had done a poll on my Instagram. If you're not over there, go check me out. It's Canada Planner Girl. Uh, and uh, I had done a poll and um, apparently people wanted to see how I set myself up. So I used the washi. I am my friend Daniela, Planner Mama Shantz. I'm not sure if I'm pronouncing it right. Um, she had sent me all this amazing washi and uh, I am determined to use it up before I go into my own stash. You know, my theory is use your stuff. So I used it last month. I did not do a video on this, but apparently a, a, quite a few of you, I think I had like um, 40 votes or something that you guys all wanted to see this set up. Um, so it's not a super duper long video. Um, I... I haven't done one of these in quite 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 some time like many years actually um but i decided to start doing um no or low spends really what i'm trying to say is no sticker spends um or low sticker spends um in my month but also like <laughs> Uh, and I've said this many times before and le let me know in the comments down below if you feel the same way but um if, as a result of the pandemic, my thing is anytime I go out in public, I get a little treat um, because in the pandemic, that was like once a week, once every two weeks, especially with a newborn. Um, but we're three years in and I go out every single day. I don't need a treat every single day and I don't need to be spending every single day. Um, so I put the washi at the top and I messed up my boxes, um, that top box where I'm writing in the days of the week, that should not be a uh, double, um, so it goes dot, um, and then a middle dot and then a bottom dot and that what makes up the box. It just should be one row of the dots, grids, uh, dot grid that is in the Bujo. Um, but whatever, I don't think it looks too, too bad. It's like, it's not my favorite. I feel like I could have done it better, but it's not my favorite. Um, but then everything else is done correctly. And I do actually have dots on the page. Ooh, excuse me. Um, I... I'm just not good at freestyling it. That's also why I have a ruler. My hand um, is not steady enough to do that. Um, but I I went back and forth about if I should start on like the 3rd, which was on a Monday, or if I should start on the 31st. Either way, I was going to have a lot of extra days. So I elected to start on the 1st. The 31st I can bring into August because it is... Um, on a Monday, so and I have a Monday start, so I'll just have no empty days for the month of August. So I'm really excited about that, uh, and I'm just putting in my days. Um, each of my grids, this is the Nota notebook, and this is two years old now. Um, it's from Indigo, and actually, um, my friend uh, Bex got it for me for my birthday two years ago, and then she got me one for Christmas last year, but I still haven't used this one, and I'm determined to use up the whole thing, which is really good. So it's like, it's a thick, thick, thick bujo, and I just, it's working for me. Um, but also, I'm really liking mm. the accountability of um, putting in my, my no and low spend days. So I love the colors that I chose this month, a uh, minty green and a nice soft purple. I just put a tiny arrow at the bottom into the next day. And then I'm going to go in and I'm probably going to, yep, do a diagonal line for all the days that are just not in the month. I've just been doing that for forever and I kind of like how it looks. So, um, I'm just doing that. And then because I, I did film this, I believe I filmed this Actually, I know I filmed this on the 6th, um, but then I started filling in my days. So I wanted to see how everything looked on um, my June no spend, and it looked pretty good. As you can see, I had a really good run on Thursdays, if not spending on Thursdays. Not so, um, not so this month, but this month is a bit different. So, um, yeah. I, I don't, yeah, I honestly, I kind of want, um, like I wanted to do 
I want to get brave enough to do where you like write the letters in like just a regular pen in just all caps or printing over the cursive, but I'm just not quite brave enough to do that yet when it comes to like a spread, but I'll, I'll get there. So my goal for this month, because there are 31 days or 16 no spend days. And then I put actual because I'm realistic. If I have to spend, then I have to spend. And I do have two kids and sometimes things get spent. Sometimes you just have to spend when you don't intend to. So I decided to use, um, the blue or the mint rather, uh, for my spend days. And then I elected to use the purple for my no spend days. And I just like making a little, um, map or key on the side just for myself to remind myself. Cause sometimes I'll forget. I've got mom brain. Um, yeah, I just filled in one of the boxes on each of those. And then we'll get into what I spent already because that's the, the most fun part is to fill this in. So you should be seeing this go up on the 11th um, or the 12th. I'm not quite sure. And then I've got a small haul video that's going to go up on the 14th or 15th. Um, and so as you can see, I had one no spend day to start my month, which I was really, really excited about. Uh, and then another no spend day. Um, on Friday, uh, the 7th, uh, and I happened to know that it was a no spend day because I just didn't have anything to buy and I had already been out of the house and did my walk. Uh, but I also knew in advance that Saturday, um, we were going to, we were going to, um, the rib fest in my area and I was going to be spending on that day. So I definitely pre-filled it in because I knew that it was something that I was going to be spending on. Um, and then I had a run of real bad days and I spent every single day this week. Um, some of it necessary bills, everything like that. And some of it super duper unnecessary which really irritated me, but, uh, so let me know in the comments down below. I've already run this poll over on my Instagram and it's pretty definitive, but if you pay a bill, does it count as spending or is it considered a no spend day because it's a scheduled payment that was already going to come out of your account? So let me know what you think in the comments down below. Um, next month, I will probably end up also showing you how I put in the days of my month um, to get my weekly setups done. But this is everything for now. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed, I would love to have you here. Please hit that subscribe button and I will see you in the next video. Doodles.